Yeah, 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 yeah. Die line, die line with the boom pal. Every week now I switch to a new style. Two twelves in the back just blew out. Everything I do end up in a new style. Yeah. Hey everyone, welcome to the video. Uh, my shirt is in the thing because I had to position the camera in a certain way. Sorry if the bottom right of the screen is a little cut off. People did ask me to make it bigger. Today I'm going to be doing a tutorial on how to get better at uh, mouse controls, you could say. But uh, it's just my personal preference on what I do, um, what you guys should do. Because honestly, uh, mouse controls a lot easier. You don't have to keep your f fingers over here the entire time. You can just stay strained in the back, you know. I'm wearing uh, jammies. But... Uh, I'm wearing the same shirt I wore to school. Okay. So, uh, quick pointer, guys. If you are using mouse, you just have to get used to it. You know, a lot of people are going to be annoyed. But, you know, just keep playing with it. Just keep playing with it. You know, you'll get used to it after time. Um, here, we're going to switch shirts for this battle just because of, uh, you know, the battle. Um, how about we use Railgun? Railgun's a good uh, one. Okay, so we're gonna switch equipment. You want to look where you're going most of the time. You have to like figure out like the middle of the screen. That's a lot of the thing. You have to just figure out, you know, get the best eye coordination that you can. Try and figure out where's the middle and where's it pointing at. That's one big problem because like, it, that's one problem when I started making this. Um, when I started doing mouse controls, it was like telling where to shoot just because of how complicated it was. Oh my gosh. It's a lot of like moving. Like you have to know where you're going to move. You have to know like where to go. It's a lot of like getting used to the camera angle because the camera angle is a lot different. It looks kind of weird. But uh, this one's more like getting used to it. You know, it's not too hard once you get used to it, but it is different than what you guys would be playing with. Um... I do use the uh, WASD, I don't use the mouse thing just because I can get the most uh, stretch area with this. Oh geez, the camera shake because I put it on the weirdest area so that I could uh, share the screen so I'm trying to not let it fall off. Okay, see, like we're going to go after this guy. Boom, railgun shot. Damn, that magnum actually has the shot effect. I don't know if people, I don't know if people even use that. Okay. Honestly, for aiming, getting down, make sure you go all the way down so you can just see, like, you know, where the center of your turret's pointing. It's kind of just, uh, getting used to it, you know. Because a lot of the time you'll miss your shots, you know, and it'll be hard. After this battle, I'll show you guys, uh, the best way to freeze. Jeez, why am I lagging? But freeze is one of the ones, like, f freeze, um, fire. Those are the ones you guys are going to have to get used to more just because that's a lot more turning and stuff and having to get used to a camera. Angles and stuff like that. Oh, jeez. Just like that. Gold already. You know. Like, I'm kind of just used to knowing where to point my turret just because of how much I play with mouse controls. You know, I play with it a uh, good. Uh, at least 60% of the time I play just because it's annoying to have to keep your hands over there all the time so it's always nice to just you know chill out just play normal like you normally would with any other game with mouse and stuff like right now I'm just looking around like without even my turret being like kind of all the way turned around you know it's easier to look around this is the biggest perk for um, I think mouse control players is just being able to know where people are without having to turn your turret all the way around that's the like one of the biggest perks with mouse controls is knowing where your enemy is before your turret is in their field of view so that you can actually see them before um, they see you. Okay. It doesn't really help in, you know, combat, but it does help with, uh, you know, just chilling out more, you know, not having to put all your effort into... Uh, I mean, it's his personal preference. In my opinion, I don't really like to keep my, um, I don't really like to keep my freaking, what you call it, um, well, camera almost fell off. I don't like to keep my hands on the keyboard all day, you know, if I'm grinding out stars especially. Um, I usually just like to, you know, chill out a bit, you know, just play normal like I would, like any other game, like kind of, like Siege, you know, PUBG, Fortnite, any other games that other people play. 
Because yes, it does get annoying to have to freaking keep your both hands on the keyboard the entire time. See my arm for some reason. Next battle we'll try a freeze so I can show you guys that because the freeze does involve a lot more skill when you are with because you have to like look around and then you also have to know where your turret is while looking around and so it involves a lot more you know precision knowing what you're doing. Okay, grab that guy, take the shot on him. Boom. And as you can tell, my sensitivity is very high. You don't really need a high sensitivity for uh, this game just because you know you're. Unless you really want to like turn your turret like all the way around, then it's a little bit higher sensitivity, but oh, God, it's cold in my room or office. Um, a lot of people have been requesting this video, so I decided, you know, why not make it? Everyone's like, how do you play with mouse controls? You know, why not give you guys an insight on how, on how I like to play it more? Jeez, come on. This guy messed with me. Can we please kill him? Hope you get the skill. And there's a lot of uh, assisted stuff that happens in the game. Like I don't know how to explain it, but they do assist you a good amount. Jeez, shake. stop shaking, camera. Like if I'm just moving normal, your turret will turn by itself, and that also gets a lot of people annoyed just because they'd rather the turret stay in the same position and not keep moving. But uh, it does, yeah, you're gonna have to get, it's, it gets a lot of getting used to, especially um, if you guys are new to mouse in general. Like a ton of getting used to. How's he not dead? Jeez Louise. Okay, we got the kill there. Okay. This guy's probably dead. This guy has protection since when? Huh. For some reason my FPS keeps going down every couple minutes, every couple seconds, I don't know why, sorry about that quality. And it's kind of bright, I should have turned off my lights, but you guys wanted to, it's probably better that I show you guys my full hands and stuff. Jeez, it's cold. <sighs> Why's my camera hasn't fallen off my freaking monitor? Because I it's, can't stands cost like twenty bucks, so I'm try I tried to just lay it on my second monitor. Looking over here, because if I had it on my first monitor, there's not enough field of view to see. I missed that, but that's just because like it's hard to tell where your shot's gonna go a lot of the time, and it's kind of just like knowing. This guy, hopefully, we can get a shot off. Okay, he's low. He's low. Oh, jeez. Go after him. Damn it, nah, he's gonna cap, that sucks. How close, oh, he was close to dead too, Rip, that does suck. Damn, how long is this battle? Since the camera's in the way, I can't see how long this battle ends. But it feels like it's been on for an eternity. Secretly entered 999 battle plays the entire time. I would honestly kill myself. Jeez, that was a nice mind placement. Oh my god, overdrive noobs. Okay. Um, honestly, um, turrets like Ricochet, Twins, um, Striker are a bit easier. Okay, not Striker with Uranium, that's honestly kind of hard to get used to. But now we're going to try out Freeze, show you guys uh, a little bit more info on how to use this, because it will take a lot of time if you guys are not used to mouse at all. Okay. I did move back a bit more. Hey, Alphas. Oh my gosh. I was really shaking the camera. Caps locked full. Okay, let's see how we do here. Alphas black. I don't have a freeze effect right now on my turret. I just kind of took it off. I don't know why. That was kind of dumb. Nah, you're dead, bud. I'm sorry. I had to kill you. Lol, well, he's going to get mad at me. Actually, no, he doesn't really get mad at that stuff. Honestly, if someone kills you in their friends list, just ask them to stop. Don't say, what the fuck, what the heck? 
Okay, um, what do I say here? Uh, I'd honestly say for freeze, it's just honestly getting used to where, you, where your turret's gonna be, you know, knowing exactly where your turret's gonna be most of the time. Just because yes, it does take a while to get used to knowing. Because you're gonna your turrets, your your field of view is gonna be there like two seconds before your turret actually gets there. I'm not gonna go for this gold. I'm just gonna go for kills. Actually, no, I'll go for the gold. Never mind, I didn't get the gold, but that's okay. Who really cares? It's a normal gold. <laughs> it feels a container. I'd be mad. Hmm. Okay. You stuck a dog shit to Sita. Yep. Alpha's mad. Not me though. Okay. Yeah, but that is the number one hardest thing with mouse controls is your field of view, your position that you're looking at will go to where you're looking at before your turret actually gets there. And so you'll be shooting and you'll waste like half a shot like thinking your turret's already there, but it's actually not. It actually does take a bit of patience because you'll have to wait for your turret to finally end up. Oh my god, full drug, dude. Andy is from Acida. Go after the Acida, go after the Acida. Please kill him. Oh my god. That seat is dumb. Stupid Aceta. Oh, this is a soul that I didn't even realize. Yeah, Alpha just saw me. Oh my god, I'm so be surprised that, that freaking thing falls off. I wouldn't be surprised actually. Hmm. Okay, this is kind of a bad battle to show. It's kind of harder. Dude, this guy's a personal Aceta. Honestly, F off, kid. Does this guy take protection against me? No. For some reason, damage is low right now. Oh my god, the impact on his twins. That was annoying the hell out of me. Oh my god. That camera's gonna fall off, lol. Okay. Try not to move too much just because I'm scared my freaking camera's gonna fall off. Okay. Kill this dumb Aceta, kill this dumb Aceta, he's actually annoying. Personal Aceta, F off. I hate personal Acetas. Toxic kid. Ricos, where's my Rico protection? I always have Rico protection, this sucks. I forgot to put it on, I guess. Move, kid. Move, kid. If I get shafted here. Thank God he sucked. Kill him, noob noob. Haha, <laughs> get wrecked, son. This guy's gonna back up, watch this. Oh no. Yep, look, he's backing up. Haha, <laughs> noob. I'm coming after you, bud. Oh, you have to come to me, bud. You have to come to me. What are you doing, kid? Come on, kid. Oh, you ran out of. No. Now, come on! What the hell? Stupid dude. Why is there a Titan Assault? Why are you capping it with Titan Assault, bud? 400 damage. Thank God we got him. Jeez Louise. Still two minutes in the battle. Oh, I don't really want to finish this. Honestly, guys, I think I've said anything useful about it, but I'm gonna end the video here. Guys, if you have any more questions, I'll, I'll, I'd love to answer them in the comments. Um, just, I'll see you guys in the next live stream, which will be tomorrow, and then Monday, Wednesdays, and Saturdays are my live stream schedules. So if you have any questions there, just ask me. Guys, thanks for watching, and see ya.